Good morning and welcome to another Hump Day Hallelujah. I'm Pastor Scott coming to you from Ascension Lutheran Church in Citrus Heights. And this morning I'm coming to you from my office as I reflect on, on All Saints Sunday, which is coming up. We had Halloween yesterday, which All Hallows Eve, as it's often referred to, and this is a time of year in many traditions where we think about those who have gone before us. And, uh, and you know, we've got the Day of the Dead and lots of remembrances and, and reflecting on uh, the lives of those who've gone before us in the church on All Saints Sunday. We remember the saints who have gone before us. Um, and not that we only remember the good parts, but just the folks who've been significant in our faith journeys. And today I'm struck by this uh, needlepoint here that hangs in, in my office. And it's a needlepoint um, that is a picture of the church my grandmother attended in Sundsvall, Sweden. The church that she grew up in and uh, <clears throat> as part of my legacy of faith, the, the saints who have gone before me. I'm, I'm a pastor in a Lutheran church, um, partially because my grandmother attended a Lutheran church in Sweden, and she raised my mother as a Lutheran, and that legacy of faith has, has continued in, in, in me. Who in your faith journey has been important and significant? Who has um, played a, an important role? Um, I'm a collector of, I'll call it artwork, but that doesn't mean it's fancy, of, of things that remind me of significant and important um, times in my life. And we could spend uh, a number of weeks, if not months, looking at different pieces of, of artwork, um, pictures hung on the wall, and, and other reminders to me of, of things that have happened that have been important in, in my faith journey. This certainly is one, and it's a cherished reminder to me of, of uh, my grandmother and, and the faith that has come down through the generations. And there's, there's others that remind me of significant um, religious experiences or um, places that I've been, uh, my ordination and uh, my baptism and confirmation, all reminders. Um, I think on All Saints Sunday, it's a great time for us to remember Remember those who have been significant in our life journey. Remember and give thanks for their lives. And then also to reflect upon our own faith journey, our own lives, and, and maybe challenge ourselves to, to play a, a role in other people's lives as well that they might one day remember and give thanks for us, hopefully even before our passing. Who are you thankful for today? And who do you think is thankful for you and the part that you've played in their life? Something to ponder on this uh, hump day, uh, middle of the week. If you're um, in the area or online on Sunday morning, I invite you to, to join us for worship, either at 8.30 for our classic worship service or 11 o'clock for our modern worship service. Well, we will remember and give thanks for the saints who have passed since last All Saints Sunday and also give people an opportunity to remember folks who've been significant in their faith journey. I hope you have a good day, and I look forward to seeing you next time here for another Hump Day Hallelujah. Take care.